The client side adaptive image module allows you to display responsive images from a field formatter. The module resizes images via JavaScript on the client side, hence the name. This module is relatively easy to set up. There are no dependencies and you don't have to modify the .ht access file. To set up, just select the adaptive image formatter from the manage display page, define your breakpoints and you're done. Installing the module is pretty simple. Just download client side adaptive image and install the module. Throughout this video, I'll use Omega as the responsive theme. Avoid using the default Bartek theme as it's not responsive. The module ships with a custom field formatter called adaptive image for the image field. All we need to do is configure this formatter, define breakpoints and image styles and we are done. So go to structure, content types, and click on manage display within the article row. Select adaptive image from the format dropdown list and click on save. Click on the cog wheel. And here we need to define specific breakpoints and image styles. The breakpoint widths may vary depending on the defined breakpoints within your responsive theme. You have to experiment with different widths to get the right results. For this video, I will set the following options. 400 and thumbnail, 800 and medium, 1200 and large. When the browser window is less than 400 pixels, it will display the thumbnail image. Then, when the browser window is less than 800 pixels, it will display the medium image. And finally, set the maximum option to large. Save the formatter settings by clicking on update and click on save. Go to content, add content and article. Enter in a title and upload an image. Now if I resize the browser, you can see the large, medium, and thumbnail size. By default, the module allows you to define five breakpoints. But if you need more than five, you can add extra breakpoints by going to the module's configuration page. Go to configuration, adaptive images. Change the value in the number of breakpoints and click on save configuration. Now, if we go back to structure, content types and manage display, click on the cogwheel and you will see that we have 10 breakpoint options. 